Hey, how y'all been doing? Well, I've been thinking it's deer season. And I want to show you a little secret of mine. I guess it ain't many secret anymore. But I'm gonna make the best deer bait attraction ever. I mean, it's guaranteed to bring you in. I mean, hell, to be honest with you, it's really corn. That works too. But then uh, you got that deer cocaine. That brings them even more. Well, I tell you what, what we're about to make here is uh, the Biker Crystal Myth of deer bait. I mean, hell, they'll keep on coming in, and the ones we don't kill probably gonna end up on the show intervention and up on rehab. But uh, without further ado, let's let's see what we uh, got here. I'll show you what we're working with here. So. Uh, we got brown sugar, because deer love sweetness. We got four cans of salt, about 49 cents a piece. Deer love salt. We got some uh, tropical punch Kool-Aid. Deer love tropical punch. i tell you what, and plus it adds, it's, uh, adds that scent profile. And we've got some uh, baking soda. Cause like hell, you know the beer get they get heartburn. So we pour this in there so they don't get so bad a heartburn. They like it. We've got some quick oats. Do you love oats? Just like those uh, Rainier Rudolph and Dotson. <clears throat> then here's my real secret here. There's some vanilla extract from Mexico. Good buddy of mine sent me to this, and I'll tell you what, it works. <clears throat> but right now, uh, I got two cans of molasses. I got them sitting here in this boiling water. So to loosen up a little bit, so we're going to add it to our mash. Uh, we got some apple cider vinegar. We're going to add that in right now. We got two cups. Over there, or in that gives the deer the tang that they desire. And I got a little bit of cranberry juice here, just a little bit, not a whole lot, but hell, we'll pour that in here too, because deer love fruit. Pour that right in there. And, uh, <clears throat> After we start mixing this up, we're gonna add some pumpkin. Cause we love pumpkin. Right now, we're gonna take these uh, molasses out. Sit it all over to the side. And we're gonna pour this right in this bucket. My buddy Jesse uh, James here, he's gonna pour that right in there. Hurry the hell up. I ain't got time for this shit. I'm going to show as I got damn well please something, but. Alright, I know that, that water is like uh, near boiling. So it's the perfect time to add the salt. We're just going to pour all four cranes in here. Do you want it to be a. Uh... Alright, now the Kool Aid we're going to add in. Whole goddamn thing. Yeah, pour it in. And then uh, pour this in right there. Brown sugar. Yeah, we love that shit. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you, uh, old Billy Bob. Like, hey, old Billy Bob dead. Oh, he's a good Christian man. Uh, hell, he, uh, he brewed meth in his trailer house, but uh, I don't know it was a bad drug. But he's a good Christian man. He uh, he's one of the ordained ministers right on there down by the river at the Baptist Church. We got to rest his soul. Uh, he dropped, he uh, ended up dying because he's drinking and driving. He ended up dying, and killing him like 
for people. But he's a good Christian man. I don't care what to say about him. I mean, hell, he's fighting his battles. This is an interesting part right here. We're going to have a baking soda. And hell, he, he's going to foam, foam right up. Here, Jesse. And pour that in there and see what happens. Can of oats, the dear little oats. Oh yeah. All right, next we're gonna add a little bit of this uh, vanilla extract, about two tablespoons. Yeah, one more. That's good right there. I want to add these two cans of molasses. Tell you what, I was on probation for a little while. Is that back charge support? I don't understand it. I mean, it was only thirty thousand dollars in back charge support. But you know, we're politicians are assholes. But hell, we'll figure it out. What do you think about that, Rick? Pour that shit in there. We got one more special ingredient. Got some pumpkin, a dear love their pumpkin. Let's pour that shit in there, Jesse. And stir that shit. Oh yeah. It's some good. Hell, it smells awesome. I'm mean, hell, I'd eat that shit up right now. Better stop my freezer up to feed my six kids. So hell, I don't pay child support, but uh It'll be alright, I gotta look out for number one. But old Jesse down there, he's screwed up real nice. And uh, what next we're gonna do. Yeah, hey, Jesse, that's good. So we got this deer corn right here. Is this corn? About five bucks for a 40 pound bag. So hell, yeah, we're gonna. Just pour that shit in there and put that bucket right up. Mix it up. Change it on our. I do gotta show you something. Pull on, put it right back. So we got this. Brings the bucks in a rouse. Well, it's a powerful sexual attractant. So I did put on some of the tampons and I hung them in the trays. So that, that's going to bring them in, I guarantee you. There's horny books. I'm going to get right. Ain't hungry. I wish you were happy. Well, yeah, just fill that up with the corn. Hell, dogs will eat that shit. That's probably about good right there. I'll mix it up. You will uh, put it out in the yard. I guarantee the bucks will come in aroused and hungry. I guarantee it. If this doesn't work for you, I will French kiss Ron Jeremy. I'm a rational bastard, too. But I'll French kiss it. Shit out of that dude. If it don't work for you, so let me know. Uh, su subscribe if you like these videos. Uh, suggestions, questions, let me know. But alright, hey, y'all have a good night and good luck with getting those books.